Oh, I feel like my just been real good as far as knowing the plays and doing what I have to do out there and helping my teammates out, helping the defense out, making everybody look good and cheering everybody on. Now you're known, of course, for your speed. Um, what about Miami's DBs? Who's been, uh, who have been some of the faster, difficult guys you've gone up against in practice? Um, it's kind of hard because everybody plays different kind of style of DB because it's all technique of the game. So it's kind of hard because everybody plays different. Somebody like a hard boundary corner and someone a good field corner. So it's kind of hard to adjust to really say which one it is for real. And, you know, like just saying, uh, speed's obviously a huge aspect of your game. Um, have you gone up against any other receivers that determine who's the fastest so far? Um, I know very fast, too. He a little speed demon, too. And who else we have fast? We got a lot of um, fast groups. Um, Samari, I was just going to say Samari, he's, he's fast. He's sneaky fast, too. And, I mean, how much do you think that's going to help you guys kind of in that the more vertical passing game that, you know, Coach Dawson's kind of wants to integrate this year? I feel like it's going to help us out a lot, especially, like, Especially like, you feel me, the DBs knowing how fast we are, they're going to fall back, they're going to open up the run game, helping on um, TVD out, helping the O-line out, and helping us out too on a, on a low instead of going deep, we could run some short routes as well. How much has Kevin Beard kind of helped you to be a better receiver? Uh, he made me understand a lot as far as him playing a receiver himself and being around with the greats. And back time when he was in Miami, um, yeah, I just learned a lot from him. I just soak a lot of knowledge from him and, and just put my in my game and put in my respect up on the field. Tyler, what, what, you haven't played a real game yet here. Uh, what, are, what are you imagining that first game is going to be like? Or have you started thinking about it a little more now? It's yes. Yeah, I'll be having dreams about it, man. I can see myself making plays out there, going deep, catching every ball, and, and just cheering my teammates on have a victory at the Do end of the game. Do you have butterflies, especially the opening game? No, I don't have no butterflies, no. Nah. Uh, you being for Miami, how special is it to come back to play for your hometown and represent the Hurricanes? Uh, it's real special being from Miami, having a lot of family out here and a lot of kids that, that know me growing up. And it is amazing and it's a blessing too. Uh, I, know, I remember, right, you kind of dealt with some nagging injuries in the past in your career. Just how are you feeling health wise? No, I'm feeling good right now. I can run all day, every day, run speed and decelerate all that good stuff. So. It's good out here to be out here and play. And I know they, they think they like you know do they clock you guys in terms of miles per hour. Do you know what you've uh, your top speed's been since you got here? Um, here no, but I know like throughout my career I did I was consistent like 24 miles per hour. Heather, how how is this offensive? How does this offensive line compare to some other ones? Far as, as yeah, how good is and like teams offensive? like far as Louisville and Alabama like comparison or yeah, just sure and and and, and this. This, how good are these guys? Period. Uh, yeah, I feel like our offensive line real good, especially being at, I've been in the ACC before, and I ain't, I ain't never seen no good O line like this, like far as in the ACC. So I feel like we're going to take it another level what, with this. What, what, do you, what do you mean by that? You, I'm just saying, seen? like, far as like size and the toughness they have, and it's, just, it's a lot of stuff, a lot of little things, too. How, how much? easier does that make it for you and for, for uh, you know, Tyler? Uh, it make it us real good, especially for the run game too, for the running backs as well. They're going to put everything together as far as we got some speed on the receiver group, some good talent receiver group, good O-line, as far as having TVD, being a good quarterback and, and having a good run game too. So they're going to really overall going to be a good, good thing on the offense. By the way, did you grow up coming to uh, uh, Hard Rock? Did you watch some games that are hard rock? I ain't never show up to a game. I never did. Really? What do you What do you expect? Like, how important is that for you? Crowd and fans and all that. Well, uh, I know. I feel like it's gonna be. I know it's gonna be hard to fill up. Or it's gonna be a big hard rock stadium. But I hope you feel me. It'll be a decent, nice little crowd out there. We can have fun out there and win games. How would you compare Tyler Van Dyke to other quarterbacks that you've played with? For I said again. How would you compare Tyler Van Dyke with other quarterbacks that you played with? Um, Tyler Van Dyke, he a people person, and um, he also could throw the ball for me deep. So that's a good thing, you feel me? That's what I like too, as far as throwing the ball in the air. And I feel like he's a good, accurate quarterback.